Hey, what's up, Trinidad and Tobago? It's good to be back with you after a while. Um, so earthquakes, earthquakes, and more earthquakes. Actually, Trinidad and Tobago experienced two earthquakes this morning. One, while you were sleeping. The other one actually happened maybe when many of you were in traffic and not knowing. So let's get into the details right now based on what the UWI SRC has stated uh, in their bulletins. Let's get into this one first. It says the UWI SRC automatic earthquake location, the date and the time was the 7th, which is today at 3.38 a.m. local time. The magnitude of this was around 3.6. The location was 10.98 north, longitude 62.64 west, and the depth was 56 kilometers. So where did it affect? Uh, Curepano, Venezuela, Port of Spain, Trinidad and Tobago, 130 kilometers west northwest of uh, Port of Spain, also uh, Paloma in Venezuela. So this is what has been happening. This is actually the location right here. This is actually the location right here where it happened this morning. All right. So that's something that I wanted you to know about. And then we have another situation that took place this morning while many of you may have been in traffic. Date and time, the 8.21 a.m. Actually, it's 8.21 a.m. and that's 7.21. The magnitude of 5.1. So that's much bigger. Location was 10.98. The longitude 62.42. So where did people felt this earthquake? Again, Venezuela. Again, 107 kilometers west-northwest of Port of Spain. Also, Arima, 132 kilometers west-northwest of uh, arima it occurred that's the distance and direction to the epicenter we can show you this right now so this is another one that took place this morning uh and, and felt in trinidad and tobago look as i would have said to you before you don't know when earthquakes are occurring there's nothing much you can do to stop earthquakes like any other natural disaster best that you can do is to know how to prepare in terms of what to do during the event of the earthquake now there's an interesting map that um, the uwi placed out an interactive map check a look at this and it shows earthquake age hours days weeks months so you can see in the last month or so these are where earthquakes have been occurring around uh, close to trinidad um then you have the weeks which 4.9 3. Point something there and there's two more underneath there and then the hours which is 3.6 and the 5.1 this morning so they've been showing an interactive map. So that's some quick information for you, Trinidad and Tobago. I'll be back later on this evening or tomorrow with that important video that I have for you with uh, the earthquake zones that surround Trinidad. There's eight earthquake zones that surround Trinidad and Tobago. And it's just something that you really should know about Trinidad and Tobago. Have a good day and stay locked in.